Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome to this video. That's right. Uh, I want to make this video uh, very clear here. We're not going to talk about uh, highlights of uh, any, uh, you know, other things, okay? However, if we do have time in this video, I think we can make time for uh, me talking about memes, okay? I'm sure everyone loves memes, but we'll get to that later if we have time, okay? But I want to actually um, point out uh, some of these uh, uh, highlights of my own experience, my own highlights, because I, I feel like this might actually be uh, an entertaining video to watch nonetheless. I'm not sure, but let's just, let's just jump into it. Yeah, let's... Now, I think today, um, obviously, uh, as you can tell from the video title, uh, we're going to talk about my March-April highlights because uh, there's not much that really happened though, but uh, I do have like six items uh, that I do want to actually talk about uh, to really sum up these two months uh, that really happened because I think um, accumulating these two months are, are really great, I would say, all right? I think I got to take out my spectacles. It's kind of like falling out at this point. So, um, I can't see. Now, first of all, I'm sure everyone remembers uh, the video where I talk about the level camp, everyone. That's right, the level camp. Uh, I was pretty stressed out, I guess. Uh, not really, no, sorry, that was a different one. But uh, level camp, uh, a lot of things happened and I didn't really like the activities. And I'm sure you all know, okay, how I pretty much uh, uh, hated uh, having um, to do the, like, sports stuff. Uh, I don't know whether, I think I have uploaded a video before where, uh, uh, yes, <laughs> I've uploaded a video before uh, in July 2017. Uh, after I uploaded, like, every single day during that period of time. And uh, I said I was going to quit YouTube and I'll come back in uh, this year, end of this year, because I, I'm busy with my examinations. So um, then that's where I said, you know, uh, there's, uh, or maybe it wasn't that time. I think it was before, it was before that time. I had this video um, where I said I, I didn't like sports, okay. I was, um, back then in uh, 2017, I was like, kind of like not, somehow like, a bully, I would say, all right? But at least now it's better. Nothing um, bad is really happening. I think now um, uh, the, the whole thing is, is improving. Um, so back then, I, I, you know, I didn't really have a thing for sports. And until now, I don't really have a thing for sports. And I think you also seen the video recently where I uploaded I'm Socially Awkward. Um, that has something to do... Yes, I'm dropping hints now. That has something to do with why I, I don't like sports. So, um, but I won't go into detail. So that's basically level camp. Uh, I explain more about this uh, in another in the uh, in the pre video that I uploaded previously uh, in March. So uh, that's really epic, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. They're not not that epic. Level camp was not that epic, but still. Um, quite an insightful experience because uh, the first part of the camp was, you know, at least at least there's some sort of motivation. I I, I, I like that. Shout out to D David King, everyone. Yeah. Next um <laughs> next highlight of uh, the the past two months. Uh, this one's still in March, obviously. Uh, I put here school reopens for term two. Uh, yeah, I mean, nothing much really happened for this one, um, but I, I, uh, it's kind of like, uh, you know, a, an opening, uh, into the school, uh, and basically, um, okay, I might as well highlight the first day, you know, I, basically the first day back to school, um, we actually went to, uh, have a, it's called a geographical investigation, all right? Uh, if you're a fellow, uh, subscriber who, um, not are, is not actually from my school or, or something, or, and maybe may have, um, uh, maybe have, you know, gone to the city center, uh, the civic district area, uh, coincidentally on the 25th of March, uh, maybe you might have seen me around city hall, uh, just, you know, asking people, hey, 
uh, what are your views on the uh, something like what are your views on the civic district or has the civic district you know provided you know the insight into culture has it really done that you know I think um, if you have seen me there <laughs> that's pretty epic I guess but uh, I mean yeah, I mean what was the set I don't know what that that has to do with anything but either way um, score opens and uh, that's the March highlight and uh, I think yeah that's pretty much the highlight for March so, yeah. uh, there's the more highlights uh, there are uh, there are in April so I think that one's more um, um, more of a thing to elaborate on uh, rather than the March one because March there's really not much to elaborate for March other than of course the level camp which I have already elaborated and I've already explained it in a video so you can go check that out uh, hopefully, um, maybe I'll link it, I don't know, okay, yeah. You may have also um, heard me, uh, seen me talk about uh, me being stressful as well in another video, which I have uploaded as well. Um, art coursework, that's right, art coursework is one of the things that I've been stressing out on, and uh, a lot of things are really happening with that one. Um, but I think now it's uh, things are better. It's some somehow um, slightly improving. I wouldn't say it's significantly improving a lot, and uh, it and I want to teach her basically uh, the fact that she actually heard that uh, there was a feedback given. Okay, that uh, you know somebody in the class has uh, you know feedback to um, uh, to our form teacher saying that hey you know art is pretty stressful you know and uh then i think yeah she said it, it's not stressful okay it's just that i think we're, we're basically slacking all right i can't remember like what exactly she said but it's something along those lines okay i'm supposed to actually remember these but you know <laughs> but it's along those lines okay where she said it, it it's it's not stressful okay it's just that we're, we're slacking i think we're, we're slacking and we're being lazy and that's why, you know, and then we're not really doing much. That's why it, it's somehow, like, stressful, I guess. So, um, but still, okay, like, you see all the work and, like, there's there's a lot of, like, work to do, you know. But, of course, you know, you gotta, I, I, like she said, you know, gotta spend at least 30 minutes or an hour to actually, um, uh, work on it, you know, you don't have to spend too much time because you have a lot of other subjects to actually um, Cover as well to also um, study for so just spend 30 minutes if you are uh, by the way a fellow student in Singapore Who is uh, working on coursework as well? Uh, maybe this is a friendly advice. I guess just okay if you find it very stressful Okay, uh, friendly advice is that uh, just, just you know if you spend like 30 minutes, one hour or to one hour every day um, to work on the um, on your coursework, maybe give like a one, two day break during the week. Uh, and then, yeah, you know, you just, that's all you have to spend to do your coursework. So, uh, which I'm not even doing. Uh, what, what an actual man. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I, I, I don't know. This, uh, there's a lot of like, you know, these are very hard topics to talk about, but I'm here to, to talk about them, okay? Interesting. Now, I think the other thing that I want to talk about here is um, SYF, everyone. That's right. I think this one is more uh, interesting to talk about because uh, it's more um, it's more exciting. And I think I can elaborate a little bit more on, on these ones. Uh, so, SYF, um, in case you don't know, uh, I don't think I've ever said this before, but... Here's my uh, honest, uh, I don't know, I'm gonna, I guess I'm gonna come out now and then say that uh, I'm in the choir. That's right, uh, in case in case anyone uh, is wondering which CCA I'm in, oh, you know, I mean, I, I, I get this, I get this um, question sometimes where, uh, you know, people ask me, hey, which CCA are you from, you know, and of course, I, I, being me, okay, I, I can't I can't lie to anyone and say, hey, you know, I'm in I'm in this other CCA, you know. Obviously, I gotta be honest here, okay. So, choir CCA, okay, that's right. Um, before we get into um, us working hard for SYF, okay, um, I I gotta say, okay, um, I think now that um, yeah, SYF 
Yeah, that's why it's over by the way, in case you're you're wondering. But for us, um, I gotta you know give a little big thanks to uh, the choir, okay, or like you know, big, uh, amazing, amazing feedback. I guess um, I I will give a thumbs up, you know, because um, I I gotta admit the choir has been doing really well, okay. For the past two years, uh, we've been um, or at least for the past couple of months. We've been um, working very hard to uh, produce a very good SYF experience, and uh, we really worked hard. Okay, we really worked hard. We 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 went through and we jumped into it. Um, no matter what of what of the situation, we just jumped into it. We just gone into it. We drilled hard in practices. Okay, um, although this year uh, we didn't have like a um, thing where. Um, the we didn't have like additional hours of practice basically like additional two hours of practice we used to have that uh previously when we had our SYF in 2017 and uh, that one was pretty stressful i'm not sure whether that's the reason why uh we were like we got accomplishment for SYF uh, so um yeah i i think that's I'm not sure again, okay, but um, of course, okay, later on, I will reveal like um, my choir, okay, what we got as a as an award, okay, all right, uh, I, yeah, what we got as an award uh, for the SYF, okay, so I think that's pretty interesting. Now for a little break uh, to talk about Jewel Changi Airport. Um, the previous video, I think you've definitely seen me, um, gone to Jewel Changi Airport, um, in a vlog, okay? I didn't actually title it Jewel Changi Airport Vlog, I only titled it The Return of Ching's Vlog. Yeah, cause, uh, I, I wanna kinda like, uh, it's kinda like a thing where you reel people in, um, to, to let you see, like, this Ching's Vlog. I know a lot of people wanna see me do vlogs again, okay, but, uh, I don't really, I, I will still do vlogs, but it's kind of like more of an occasional basis at this point. It's not really like um very often basis anymore. I don't really want to do very frequently, very uh, most of the time anymore because uh, it's it's not that great, okay? I, maybe I'll, I'll reason, I'll, I'll provide my reasonings for this in probably another video. I don't know. I, that, that, however, this one might be like, you know, gotta wait for a few years for me to uh, talk about this i don't know uh, but uh yeah jewel changi airport okay now uh basically the previous video uh where i was in jewel i uh i was there for the jewel preview i was, i actually bought the tickets to go to jewel um and it's free tickets by the way so you can you just buy you just get it it's not buy actually in fact it's it's free and you just get the tickets and you know you you get the tickets and like they provide you with the qr code in the email or something and you download it from the pdf file and you uh, scan it on this um qr scanner at the at the gantry before you go into jewel uh either on the link bridge or directly into jewel from terminal one so uh obviously i, I went to the t tree um, link bridge because uh, I came from the train station so I came through uh, Terminal 3's uh, link bridge and uh, obviously before that you have to scan the QR code uh, on the on the scanner at the at the entrance so um, basically yeah there are a lot of people okay okay this, this is not important in, in like scanning QR code or anything um, basically there's a lot of people in Jewel okay and uh, I did the vlog and uh, it was an amazing experience, okay? The Jewel preview was an amazing experience. I really liked it. Uh, Changi Airport really did a great job on that one, okay? And uh, obviously, Jewel Changi Airport is like, um, you know, a, a place where you can have like a layover in case, you know, transiting passengers or, you know, or you're having a layover in Singapore, um, you can go ahead and uh, visit Jewel Changi Airport. Uh, even... Uh, even if you uh, also actually, in fact, I think, uh, I'm not sure whether people do this, whether foreigners actually do this, you know, when they come to Singapore, maybe next time, you know, they can come to Singapore, and then when they are about to depart out of Singapore, okay, maybe they can, uh, they actually have an early check-in, uh, service at Jewel Changi Airport, uh, which means that you can check in, um, and 
you, yeah, you can check in, put your baggage at the check-in area, and uh, you can board, uh, not board your flight, but you can explore Jewel, okay, and uh, you can still get on your flight afterwards, so yeah, which is the point of this early check-in, so uh, that's pretty great. Obviously, Jewel Changi Airport, of course, uh, I forgot to say this, um, they have this uh, the centerpiece, the very nice attraction of the rain vortex. Uh, it's obviously the tallest, um, the world's tallest indoor waterfall, and uh, it, it's been it's been highlighted everywhere. Every single time they've always they always say, oh, the rain vortex is like the is not like, but it's of it's actually the the world's tallest indoor waterfall. So that's pretty epic. Now I know this video um, does not seem to have some sort of like very, um, not very um, concrete link together. Okay, it it seems very um, um, stale. It's not really that like entertaining. But I'm sure you want to know the results of my SYF uh, thing. I don't think anyone cares, but uh, <laughs> still, all right. Um, I uh, we got distinction. Okay, in case anyone's uh, wondering, okay, and uh, it's pretty, it's a really good um, achievement. The fact that uh, other PAG groups as well, um, uh, according to today, uh, we have um, the other CCAs like band, dance, uh, also got distinction as well. Uh, well now we're just left with, uh, I think, Guzheng and um, drama, I guess. We are still waiting for them to get a distinction as well. So uh, all the best to them. Hopefully um, they can get a distinction as well for SYF and uh, do the school proud. So uh, yeah, so, yeah. Uh, I, I know this, like I said, this video is not really very um, linking, not very um, um, concrete linking, not very content wise, like not that great. I, I understand, okay, but um, this is this is a video I have to make because you know I I thought it would be very entertaining, <laughs> but either way, thank you for watching. Um, I hope you um, I hope you um, I don't know I I can't really I don't think I I can really say whether you enjoyed this video. I I'm sure you didn't you didn't really enjoy this video. All right, I guess um, I'm I guess there'll be dislikes for this video, but uh. I'm sure somebody will smash like. That's that's all I'm hoping for. But for now, um, I won't be surprised if there's dislikes on this video. So, uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.